Colonials pulled off their biggest upset in two decades, holding off number 6 UVA 73-68. GW flipped the script from the team's meeting last year, where GW played a strong first half, but fell apart in the second. This year, the Colonials' strong first was followed up by a strong second, scoring 35 in the first half and 38 in the second. It was a good game for the entire team, with four Colonials scoring in the double digits. Both Patricio Garino and Tyler Cavanaugh scored 18. Joe McDonald had 10 of his own, and sophomore Paul Jorgensen came off the bench to add 10 for himself. Crucially, GW was able to outmuscle the Cavaliers in the paint. The Colonials grabbed 37 boards, while UVA only had 33. Last year, the Cavaliers out-rebounded the Colonials by a margin of 41 to 28. GW also outscored UVA 36 to 32 in the paint. An old ghost of GW's past also did not come back to haunt them, as the Colonials were solid from the charity stripe. They hit 82% of their free throws. GW will take a couple of days off before they head down to Tampa to play South Florida on Thursday. The next home game is on November 22nd against Army. Oh, yeah. Yeah. For the GW Hatchet, I'm Zach Montalero.